Hey guys, so guess what? I did something I probably shouldn't have done, but I went thrifting again and found a few pieces, so wanted to pop on and do a quick thrift haul with you guys. So when I get home, I will show you what I got. <laughs> Hey guys, I'm back with a thrift haul and unfortunately I didn't get a chance to record my thrift haul from yesterday. I went thrifting yesterday and wanted to do a video but unfortunately yesterday got kind of busy with the kids and so I'm here now to show you the pieces that I picked up from yesterday. So I am super excited to show you what I got. And if you're new here, my name is Shannon. Welcome. I am a part-time reseller on platforms like Poshmark, Mercari, and eBay. And I do YouTube videos showing thrift hauls, mystery boxes, and tips and tricks to help with your reselling business. So I would appreciate it if you do like this content to hit that subscribe button down below so you can see future content like this. All right, so let's get right into it. I picked up two pairs of shoes and then the rest are clothing items. So I'm gonna show you the shoes first and then we'll go from there. So the first pair of shoes I got are these lovely um, espadrille wedges um, that are by the brand Joa. I think I said that right, but not sure. Correct me if I'm wrong, um, but they are a leather um, strappy wedge and they are a size 38 and a half, which I believe um, is around a seven and a half size, but I'll have to look that up and list um, the size chart in my listing. But these are practically in like new condition can see the soles have very little wear and there's like no marks on these no real signs of any major wear so I did want to pick these up and they were on sale yesterday they were 25% off um, so I only paid about eight dollars for these which for the brand is not bad I probably wouldn't pay much more for that brand because it seems to not resell as well but for these I couldn't pass these up they were too cute and their shoes um, so I had to go ahead and get those. And then the last pair of shoes is a, another pair of sandals. I know we're kind of out of that season, but you know, I had to get these. They are so cute and they're a good brand, Jack Rogers. And these are practically in like new condition too. You know, there are some, you know, water spots, um, water stains on there or sweat stains. I don't know, but still not much wear. You can see on the soles, still in very good condition. And they're size seven. So I had to pick those up and these were $9. All right, the next piece I got is a dress. It's a mini dress, color block. Um, and it has a little cutout in the back and zips down from the waist. And it's a brand I haven't heard of before. Let me show you the tag. Camilla and Mark. And um, I looked it up and it seems to be a pretty good brand. So I wanted to go ahead and give it a try. And it was also on sale 25% off. So I did pick that up. Next is a jacket, and it was really good condition, hoodie, um, jacket, zips up, and then the brand is L.L. Bean, it's a size small, it's a really, really nice jacket, um, and it doesn't even look like it has any wear, so I did want to pick that up. Good, good 
brand. It does sell well. Certain pieces um, sell better than others. And I thought that we're, with us going into the winter season that that would be a good pickup and should sell quickly. All right, next is a dress. It's got, it's like a knit, stretchy bodycon midi length and it's got kind of a cowl neck folds down there and then the brand is 1060 Sherman and it's a size extra small but I did want to pick it up because it's like new and it was um on sale as well it was a red tag and all red tags yesterday were a dollar 99 so I only paid two dollars for this and I thought it was a good pickup the brand it's a Nordstrom's um brand I believe but it's a good good brand so for that price I couldn't leave that behind next is another really good brand top I picked up really pretty ribbed with a um, ruffle collar neckline here and then the brand is Sandro and that is a really good brand this one was also on sale 25% off so I had to pick that up as well and it's so pretty all right next is a dress and it was new with tags really pretty midi length gold star print on a navy blue background with a v neckline um, and it snaps right here the neckline and then the brand is bloom chic i don't think it's anything special but i just thought this was so pretty and since it was new with tags i did want to pick that up all right next is a jumpsuit and i just saw it and thought it was so pretty eyelet really pretty blue color um tube top for the top but it does on the back have a necktie so it does tie in the like it'll be on the back and ties in the front which i thought was super cute and then it does have this cut out in the back and it is um not fully lined but it's lined right to here so the rest is like kind of see-through with the bottom legs and the legs are kind of wide um Oh, they're open actually. I didn't even realize that. So the legs are open, um, but still really pretty. And it is, um, I think this is the older tag of Young, Fabulous, and Broke. And it's a size small, but I just thought it was so pretty. And I'm, you know, really cautious about picking up Young Fabulous and Broke these days, but for that piece, I thought it was super unique. So I did want to get that. And then found another dress. This is, uh, I wasn't sure if I was going to pick it up because I couldn't find a size on it and I hate not having sizes, but because of the brand, I did decide to pick it up. It's Alice and Olivia. And it was one of those red tag sales. So it was only $1.99. So I figured, well, what the heck, I'll get it. It's a mini dress and I believe it's like an extra small. It's like super tiny, um, but I did like the back because it's got the cutout and the zip up all the way up to the neckline, really pretty. Um, and I didn't see any flaws or anything. So yeah. All right, next I saw this and I had to get it and it's a sweater, so it's perfect for the upcoming season. But look at this sweater. It is so pretty. It's kind of got like this Aztec-y, um, aztec, -y, aztec design. Um, and it's got some sequins. Um, and then the brand is Storybrooke Knits, which is a good brand and it is 55% rainy and 45% cotton. Um, but I just thought this was so unique and it's kind of like a tunic length um, 
it's a size large and it does have a couple spots on it like right there so I'm gonna have to see if I can get that out if not I'll just list with the spots and I still think it'll sell I only paid like eight dollars for this so um, and it's got the flared sleeves ribbed as well um, I just thought it was super unique so I had to get that all right next over here um, so this second thrift store I went to had um, a ton of girlfriend collective pieces and that is a good activewear brand and flies out of my closet and they had a sale going on too so most of the items I got were on the 25% off rack um, so I really scored yesterday with my thrifting um, and the sales but these are like new without tag like this place always has this brand there so I think these get donated by the store themselves um, new without tags um, but this is, I think, like um, a robe. But I have the shorts that actually go with it. Um, and I think it's the same size shorts. If not, I'll just list this separately. But it's also a large size XXXL Girlfriend Collective. So if you ever see that brand, be on the lookout because it is um, a bolo brand. And it sells pretty quickly. So... Um, I will list this with the shorts. Let me see if I can get the shorts. Okay, here's the shorts. And the shorts are only in XXL. So, but I still, I think I'll still list together because some people are different size bottoms and different size tops. So, We'll see if I'll list together or not, but I thought that was a good pickup. And each of those, the shorts were $5 and 25% off. And then the top part was $18, which is a little steep, but with the 25% off, not too bad. And um, yeah, so next I got several of these and they're all girlfriend collective um, shorts and they are like sweat shorts um and this one where is it oh here it is the size on this is another large size xxxl these are new without tag here's another pair in the mustard yellow color another mustard yellow. Since these were all $5 each and 25% off, I picked up all of these in all the colors that they had. Here's another dark green color, which I really liked, the dark green. And some of them are different sizes. This is the XXL. And then here's another blue pair. So I got two of the blue pairs, two of the mustard yellows, and one green. And then here is a hoodie with the, um, yeah, kind of waist length hoodie. And this is also from Girlfriend Collective and it's an XL, new without tags, but really comfy, cozy, perfect for um, the upcoming fall winter season. All right, next, we're done with the Girlfriend Collective pieces. Next is a dress, and it's a linen dress. Really pretty linen. And zips up at the neckline. And then the brand is Lena Tomei, made in Italy, size extra small. And Lena Tomei is a good brand. So I did want to pick that up and it was cheap. So, all right. 
Next is a sweater, striped uh, mock neck, really cute. And then the brand is Madewell, size medium. I might keep it, but I don't know. I'm more intrigued to sell it, so I'll probably end up listing it. But it is cute, it's my size, so maybe I'll try it on. Maybe I will list it. All right, next is a pair of shorts, but these are not getting listed. These are for me, but they're super cute. Brand is Henry and Bell, which I don't think it's anything super special, but I thought they were cute, and so I got them for myself. All right, next is another pair of shorts. Um, Bermuda style jeans and they are from one of my favorite jean brands Judy Blue and they're a 1XL stretchy distress and this brand seems to do well in my closet so if you see that brand I say pick it up all right last item is this new with tags really pretty black and white striped pleated a line dress here's the bag zips in the back and then um it is the brand lauren ralph lauren and because it is new with tags and it's a good brand i wanted to pick it up it's a size eight so that is it for my haul. I hope you enjoyed it. And um, I will be back again shortly with another haul, I'm sure. So make sure to hit that subscribe button. Um, if you like this video, I'd appreciate a thumbs up and hit that notification icon so that you can be notified when I do post new videos. All right, well, you guys take care. Have a great weekend and we'll see you again soon. Bye.